Artificial intelligence, or AI, has stirred diverse opinions across society, shaping two primary schools of thought. On one side, there's optimism and excitement over AI's potential to solve complex problems, improve efficiency, and enable scientific and technological breakthroughs that were once unimaginable. Proponents of AI highlight its applications in fields like healthcare, finance, and education, where AI-driven tools have already saved lives, predicted market trends, and personalized learning experiences. This school of thought sees AI as a tool for advancing human capability, unlocking new ways to address age-old problems. On the other side, skeptics caution against AI's potential to disrupt economies, privacy, and even our understanding of human agency. This view, fueled by concerns about job displacement, misuse of data, and the risk of overly autonomous systems, warns that AI could lead to unintended consequences if left unchecked. These individuals worry about AI's rapid pace and its implications for societal values, often influenced by media representations that paint AI as a harbinger of dystopian futures. Between these two perspectives lies a balanced view that recognizes AI's potential while urging ethical guidelines and responsible usage to prevent misuse and unintended harm. Many people perceive AI as a revolutionary technology that seemingly appeared out of nowhere, disrupting our established way of life. However, the core concept behind AI, using data and knowledge to build upon existing ideas, is not new at all. For centuries, writers, scientists, educators, and various other professionals have employed similar processes to advance knowledge and spark innovation. Just as a scientist builds on previous theories or a writer draws inspiration from established literary traditions, AI systems learn from vast databases of pre-existing information to generate insights and solutions. AI, in essence, is a tool for augmenting the human process of discovery and creation. It can analyze enormous amounts of data at once, recognizing patterns and drawing connections much faster than a human ever could. These patterns are either suggested by the user or derived by AI, but based on some preconceptions. But this process isn't fundamentally different from the way academics build upon established theories or how craftsmen refine their skills by learning from their predecessors. The tools may be new, but the underlying principle of collecting, analyzing, and repurposing knowledge to move forward is timeless. Understanding how AI works and knowing how to use it effectively is a significant hurdle for the average person. Many people approach AI with a mix of curiosity and fear, shaped largely by caricatured portrayals of AI in pop culture as either a powerful ally or an uncontrollable force. These narratives often overlook the nuances of AI and can lead to a misunderstanding of its actual capabilities and limitations. For instance, Fears that AI will take over ignore the fact that, in most cases, AI lacks true autonomy and operates within human-defined parameters. The fear some people feel toward AI is often rooted in a lack of understanding, leading to a hesitancy to engage with or use AI tools meaningfully. Misconceptions arise when people assume AI is either far more advanced than it is, or conversely, that it's nothing more than an automated task completer. This polarization can prevent people from recognizing AI's real value. Those who fear AI often do so because they view it as a black box, an incomprehensible system that processes data in ways they cannot understand. However, with education and a clearer portrayal of AI's mechanics and limitations, this fear can be transformed into informed caution and respect. Using AI properly involves more than just feeding it data and hoping for insightful results. To make the most of AI, users must approach it with an informed perspective, leveraging what they already know to guide the AI in producing meaningful outputs. AI's role in research, education, and content creation should be that of a supplementary tool rather than an oracle. Users need to critically evaluate the results AI produces, verify information, and apply their judgment in interpreting outputs. A practical way to integrate AI into one's work is to treat it as a research assistant that helps gather and organize information. By collecting materials, interpreting them cautiously, and validating sources, users can create more nuanced and reliable outcomes. AI can enhance this process by offering suggestions, identifying patterns, and generating insights that align with the user's goals. However, it's crucial to treat AI's outputs as provisional findings information that should be scrutinized and corroborated rather than blindly accepted. 
The concept of the golden source trusting but verifying. The idea of a golden source, a trusted primary reference point, has long existed across professions. For financiers, Bloomberg may serve as a reputable source for market data. For academics, peer-reviewed journals hold that place. For medics, libraries and databases of medical research are essential resources. These professionals have learned to consult but also to question these sources. They use the information as a starting point, verifying and adapting it based on new insights and context. In the same way, AI can act as a golden source for specific types of knowledge as long as users approach it with critical thinking. It's valuable, but not infallible. Just as professionals in finance, medicine, or academia use established sources to supplement their own knowledge, AI should be viewed as one more tool in a broader toolkit, meant to complement rather than replace human insight. Recognizing AI as a helpful but not definitive source of information aligns with the tradition of verifying and contextualizing knowledge, a practice essential to any field. The Role of Adaptation and Iteration – A Lesson from the Wealthy Throughout history, those who achieved success, whether in business, science, or the arts, rarely relied on a single idea. Instead, they adapted and iterated on their ideas as new information came to light. The wealthiest and most influential figures often began with a foundational concept but remained flexible, adjusting and reshaping their strategies based on market shifts, technological advancements, and consumer needs. The ability to evolve an idea, to incorporate new knowledge, has been a key component of enduring success. AI can be used in a similar way. It allows users to iterate on ideas, gaining insights, making improvements, and evolving concepts over time. Just as the rich and successful have leveraged information to continually refine their strategies, users of AI can take preliminary outputs and refine them, turning a basic idea into a well-developed innovation. AI's ability to process new information and present it in fresh ways supports this iterative approach, allowing us to continually adapt and improve upon our ideas. Conclusion, AI and I, building upon generational knowledge. Ultimately, the relationship between AI and humanity is a reflection of how we have always built on past knowledge. Our existence is generational, marked by the continual layering of ideas from one era to the next. AI fits into this lineage, helping us to preserve, analyze, and expand on what has come before. It offers a powerful means to accelerate learning and innovation, but it also challenges us to use it thoughtfully as one would any other tool. I recall a comment on the car problem diagnostic tool where the question, does it discover every fault in the car met with a resounding no response? The responder went on to say that in his case, the issue with his car was discovered not by the car diagnostic tool, but by a man of learning and experience in the things of car mechanics. The car diagnostic tool in this scenario is a somewhat reflection on how we view AI ML not as panacea for all ills. Something that has always been a weakness for us humans as demonstrated by the successful marketing of the carbolic smoke ball as panacea for all ailments in Victorian England era. As with all innovations, the successful use of AI requires an understanding of history and context. We are reminded of the adage, he who fails to learn from history is doomed to repeat it. AI, when used wisely, can prevent us from falling into this trap by helping us access and build on the insights of those who came before. By approaching AI with a balance of curiosity, caution, and a commitment to critical thinking, we can ensure that it enriches our world rather than limiting it. In this way, AI and I, and all of us, can continue the generational journey of innovation, learning, and human progress.